That lil' young ain't up to something, he gon' roll when it's right Ain't no question, they gon' make him take a soul in the night Once he ran from automatics, he done Yo, yo, what's going on? What's good? Oh, not shit. What's going on with you? Chilling out, for real. Chilling out. Now, for people that's watching this interview right now, and they may be asleep or under a rock, who I got in front of the camera? You have the one and only Miss Candace Andrew. They am a model, a supermodel. I do runways and everything like that. I'm very versatile. I'm just the Jackie Brown of all her traits, a real deal hustler, and just an all around bad bitch. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Pop your shit then, for real. Now, you did say something like normally I hear model, I hear supermodel too, but what are the differences between those two? Um, just because I can do all types. I've done editorial. I've even posed for Playboy twice. Mm. Um, I've done major runway shows. I did LA Fashion Week twice. I walked in New York Fashion Week last year, and um, I have two more coming up this coming year. Damn, that's impressive for real. Now, if you could put like your resume up against any other models around this area, like where would you rank yourself? A ten. Damn. A ten. I gotta get myself. <laughs> for sure, for sure, for sure. And it's just another thing. What kind of separates me from other models is I really got it out the mud for real. Like I didn't get no handouts. You know, my mom was my manager at first, but unfortunately, I did fire her. Sorry. What? Mom. <laughs> Damn. I know she watching this. She gonna be like. Yeah, but I did fire her, so I really just been doing everything solo. So all of this stuff going on is all off the strengths of me. And I did get signed to an agency last year, um, Exclusive Models, located in Dallas. So shout out to Exclusive Models and to Jace, the owner of the agency. Damn, um, that's major for sure. Shout out to that for sure. Now, let me ask you this. You know, you just fired your mom, or I don't know when you fired her, but you did fire her. What was that process like? How did you even approach that? So basically, I had a shoot. Uh, I think I was shooting with Nikon. This was like December of 2021. And we had got into a little argument. So I was just like, okay, you know what? I'm going to fire you as my manager. You said I'm with my mama, but I'm going to fire you as my manager. Damn. <laughs> How did she take it? She was like, okay. It's <laughs> <laughs> funny, for real, for real. Yeah. Now, with you being with an agency now, what do you think is different with you being independent and now with you being with the actual agency? Like, what's some things that's changed along the lines? Um, Some things that has changed, kind of like, you know, before I was signed to an agency, you know, I was only doing one look. I was always shooting in lingerie. I was pretty much always naked all the time. Like, I had to know what it was. But it's just like, once I got with them, that kind of like simmered down because Jay's literally like told me, so cover up, it's okay. You still look good. You still fine. Like, cover up. It's okay. So I kind of just took that and ran with it. So I've just been doing different types of looks all over. And then what kind of inspired me to want to do more looks was um, LA Fashion Week. And they had me in different types of looks. Like, I think one of them, they had me in, like, a bodysuit. And I was walking around with the whip. I don't know if y'all seen it. <laughs> oh, I've seen that. I've seen that one. And you had, is what's that in LA where you had the baggy jeans and the hat and the blue jacket? Yeah. Yeah, that was a good fit too for those. Yeah, they had me in a swimsuit. They had me in some athletic wear. And it's just like, oh, okay. Like, I can do all of this. So. Now, for you personally, though, which one do you rather do? You rather do the lingerie look or the covered up look? Which one would you rather go with? It? I keep trying to I mean, make anything look good. I really wanted to do it all. <laughs> I remember we did our first interview, like, maybe a couple of years ago. You was, like, against the not showing the body type, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It wasn't really on that for real. Like, what changed and what inspired you to, like, open up more? Um, just, you know, I don't want to attract a, you know, oh, shit, I can't talk, I'm sorry. No, you good. <laughs> but uh, I just don't want to attract the wrong audience. You know, there are little girls that look up to me, mm -hmm. you know, I, I got nieces that adore me, and people that I don't even know that say that I inspire them. You know, there's people always coming in my DMs asking me tips about modeling. I always give them. So that's what kind of inspired them because it's like, you don't have to just shoot in lingerie all the time. You can put a turtleneck on, still look good, still win people over. So that's really like what inspired it. Good, good, that's